Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. New Zealander Hannah Wilkinson, FIFA Women's World Cup 2023 Biggest Event for Country New Zealand is known as a sporting country. That punches well above the weight of its 5 million people. From cricket to rugby, New Zealand teams have shown on the world stage. Now a S football S turn as New Zealand prepares to join Australia to host the FIFA Women's World Cup 2023. From 20 July to 20 August, and football ferns forward Hannah Wilkinson, believes it will surpass anything the country has hosted to date, including the Rugby and Cricket World Cups, to come ahead for the country. For us, it is the biggest event in the world. The last World Cup had record-breaking prospects. It is just huge. Hosting this tournament will bring about a sea change. ITS, a global championship sport it is, not a sport that is really seen very often in New Zealand. We re-rugby mad and we re-cricket mad, but what I'd like to see after this World Cup, is that we re-a football mad country too? A World Cup is the pinnacle event for any footballer representing New Zealand. Well at hero in New Zealand, it is a great honor for me, she says. Every time I get to wear the jersey, it is an honor. But even for a season legend of the team. 2023 will be a new experience. For the first time in her career, she will play in front of home fans, and especially her loved ones in a major tournament, without anyone having to cross multiple time zones. You don't have to travel affirms Wilkinson, New Zealand. We re a team that usually has to travel so far and that s why we end up with just a small group of fans. So for the parents, the families and the friends who have been able to travel so far, for so long now being able to take everything home and just drop by a one-way trip to the game is quite special, to be honest. Important is the continued growth of women's sport in New Zealand. A year after the country hosted both the Women's Rugby World Cup and the Women's Cricket World Cup, I think women's sport has really come a long way, but I think we still